Wee! Oh god. Oh god. Uh, ah. This is going to be an interesting match. Oh, you son of a... <laughs> hey, Lamo. Oh! Oh, God. But Tharsil is the one furthest ahead. Ah! Go, 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 Should go, go, a warrior go, go, go. fall oh. into the water, uh -huh. they will have to swim to the end. Right behind him oh, my. is that warrior. Cannot remember his Zarto. name. Zarto. I'm Zarto. Zarto. And Tharsil are first and second, ah. respectively. Currently in third place is Madrad. Are you serious? I have to go all the way back? Oh god, no. I love this. Oh, I really now love made it to this. The far side. Uh, he is truly inspiring oh, in trying to beat all of the other warriors. Wee! Come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, wait. I feel so much. Zarto is now at the second point. And Madrad is at the third point. Hey, Alarki. Alarkai and Talro. Tarsil, are here. I'm going to. But Herani is lost in the maze. He must find his way through. God dang it! Ah, oh. Overjump. Oh, gosh, I... No, 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 no. There we go. Ah, Jesus. Oh God, dang it! But Tharsil is the closest to making his parkour passable. Will the other warriors be able to catch him, I wonder? Uh, so far, this parkour is panic. Don't. Talro narrowly makes it to the next part of the parkour, while Herani is finally <laughs> escaping the maze. Ah. Hallelujah. Tharsil is now to attempt his parkour, but he misses the first jump. I should make one more. Slow Will process. Make it? Tharsil is now at the final segment. Wait, he must go through the stone barriers. Ignore the leaves, warrior. The leaves will leave you devastated. How much do I need? I need one. Okay. Tharsil, you must go through the cobwebs. But there are paths you can follow if you look down. So slow and painful. Yes! The other warriors are moving through as well. But Wait, in are? second place at the moment is Zarto, coming up very close behind our first place Tharsil. Oh but no! But it seems Tharsil is here first. The question is, what emblem will he achieve when he reaches his goal? Whichever one's closest to me. Tharsil, this one. Yes. You yes. the wave. No! Oh, no! Yeah. I wanted the wave! Traumatizing your fellow yeah, Zarto, who is now ah. having a hissy fit. Kind of fits because I'm blue. Madrad has Nobody now moved die. past this location and is now at the cobwebs along with Zarto. The other three warriors are yet to be seen. No wonder why. Ah. Maybe they underestimated oh, the warriors' race. Well, who knows? Maybe. Wait, Come on, you can do it. Oh. Do I get it? Come on. <sighs> Anything <sighs> but the moon. <sighs> Zarto. You are the tree. Well done. Yay. I'm very confused. You must well, go through oh, the I'm stone a... pillars, warrior. Yeah, I, I get it. <laughs> I went on the leaves, I'm a dumbo. It seems that third place will be going to Madrad. But the question is, oh. what emblem will he take when he reaches the bank? I mean, a lot of Come on, Madrad, you got this. Come on. Got it. Got him. Madrad, come on. Come on. Oh, it's so close. Madrad, you must now pick a side. You are the mountain. Oh, yeah. An interesting choice. Oh. Where do I and go here is a Larkai, making his way up the bank. Come on! Yeah. Come on, no Malaki, Alarki. Alro and Herani are yet to be seen. <laughs> Where the hell do I go? Alarkai yeah. takes the sun. Let us see how the final two oh, warriors are faring. Oh, I know. I, uh, I'm just like it. many okay. of the other warriors. You neglected to go through the middle rings because I don't know what's wrong uh, with you. Because I haven't realized that these are 
they are. I haven't seen them, so yeah, they're red me. Herani is struggling to make it past his own parkour. No wonder I'm wearing glasses, I'm blind. Rest in pepperoni. Rest, rest in okay. pepperoni, Heroni. <laughs> but Talro falls coming, into guys. the cobweb, which is a terrible mistake to make, as it makes him very slow. Eh, I managed. And I fear Heroni cannot catch up. He is far behind. How about mustard? I mean, it doesn't matter too much now, though. It's only about emblem at this point. Yeah. Yeah. And also not coming the in last. The question is, that what down, emblem so. will Talro take? The moon or the cloud? Found out in the next. Come on, Mezzo. You can be this guy. Come on, Mez. His name is Talro. Oh, His name is Talro. His name is Talro. Tauro, Tauro, the sky is the limit, you got this! The sky is the limit, quite literally, eh? For either emblem it is. Wait, which one are the left? The moon and the cloud. Moon and... And... Heroni, will he make it? I swear. Heroni, will he make it? Please tell me he will make it. Heroni has wait, made it! Wait, he must now go through the stone me? platforms and make it to the I end. Don't see what Heroni is. He has just made it past the piston location. Oh, good job. <laughs> Oh my god, we're going to be waiting here for longer than anyone has ever waited before on this challenge. Warriors, this Come challenge on. once went on for eight minutes. Trust me. Hey, the one next to Josh and, uh, uh not, no, sh shut me, Zardo and... Come on, Talro. Talro is... Um, I like you guys, I'm gonna be cloud. in the next well yeah. well Meaning Hedony. Okay. Oh, which means Herony is the moon. Hedony is the moon when he arrives. Ooh, I'm in this company. <laughs> It may be pleased to know that Raven veterans know that Heroni was once in a cancelled tournament that was unable to be funded. We did not have the budget. And he was the moon there as well. So this is interesting. Oh, no. Oh. Navar must have been pretty disappointed. No, Navar was the one who cut the budget. Oh. <laughs> what a coincidence. What, before he got any screen time? What sort of, what sort of strategy Navar only had screen time in the first tournament. In the second and third tournament, he was replaced by Lady Navar. Mm. Is she single? What about in the fourth tournament? In the fourth tournament, Navar made a return. <laughs> Hedony, so look at the ground. Lady you can see the soul single? sand that you must oh, swim through. Come on, Hedony, take your time. <laughs> in the fun fact, I also finished sixth in Warriors Race as well. That is true. You are currently reliving yeah, your past. How fun. However, in the past, you made it to day four, if I remember correctly, so... Well, it was about that. You just need to run through the cobwebs, Warrior. There's there's no rush at this point. <laughs> rush B! Rush B! Come on, I wonder what comes the moon, Warrior! What, what, what is it going to be? I wonder. I, wonder. I don't know. You are the moon. <gasps> yes. Oh my Moon god! Like Warriors, oh, yeah. you have done an excellent job of making it into this land. You have made me proud. But now, the true tournament will begin. Go. Warriors. After that impressive victory for you all, you conquered this, the Warriors race, and have now entered my land, the land of Alaunus, where Raven bids you greetings. So, in your passage to make it to this dangerous location, you have each earned an emblem upon which you will bear for the rest of the tournament. It will represent your many triumphs and failures. Let us start with you, Zarto. You are the tree. You will grow mighty, like the trees that you can see behind your standard, growing along the cliffs. May you rise to the top, and may your wisdom lead you to victory. As for you, Alarkai, you are the sun. The sun glistens down and heats up this land, making things much more intense for all of the people that live in it. You are also responsible for everybody sweating, which is not the best. But, you will do this emblem proud. You are already dressed in the proper attire, your red clothing. As for you, Talro, you are the cloud. You represent that which soars high above the rest of the world. You represent the great heights that warriors have tried to reach. And for some, greatness has been just slipped from their grasp. Maybe you will be able to give this emblem the victory it deserves as the cloud. Tharsil, you 
are the wave. The wave, like the ocean before you, swallows everything, crashes upon its foes, and leaves no mercy. So, let us see how you will fare with this emblem that has proved problematic for some, as its colossal tides have been able to wash away hope and despair. Madrad, you are the mountain. Tall and strong, you provide a foundation for this land. You will have to reach new heights by soaring above the clouds with these great precipices that you call your emblem. I wish you the best of luck, as you prove that the mountain is not an emblem to be trifled with. And lastly, you, Hironi. You represent a legacy, the moon. In the night, the moon shines bright and brings light down to this world where once there was none. It casts shadows, but it also casts light. You will have to represent this emblem, and you will do it proud, I am sure. Now then, warriors. After claiming your emblems, I am not done with you yet. You see above your standards, a feather. These feathers are nine in total, and mark your lives. Keep them well, for if you fail in a challenge in the future, you will lose a life. And should you lose all your lives, or lose too many at the end of the second day onwards, you could find your quest at an end. But before that, three of you managed to make it to this land quicker than the others, and you deserve rewards. Tharsil, you were first to the end of Warrior's Race. These three gold rings are yours. Zarto, you were second. Two gold rings are yours. And Madrad, you were third. This solitary gold ring is yours. Now, warriors, these rings are important, as collect nine of them, and you can exchange them for a precious life. Effectively, they are what ties you to this land. Place them on your standards. Now then, warriors, with this business done, we must venture further into this land. Are you warriors ready to brave the petals of this land and bring down the darkness that threatens to swallow it whole? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. 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 Well then, warriors, let the quest begin. Warriors, for the first quest challenge that you will be facing, it is one that every warrior must go through at one point or another. This is the Stepping Stones. In this challenge, two warriors will race to the center of the loch from both side platforms. Your goal is simple. Make it to the far back here, and then move towards these chests. You must collect the rings from the chest that is closer to your starting bank. So if you start over here, you must collect this chest and vice versa. After collecting the ring, you must then race to the far side of this dangerous loch, where you will find a golden platform. Should you reach the golden platform first, then the ring that you obtained in the chest will be yours. But should you come second, or should you fall in the water at any time, you will lose a life. Now then, how am I going to split you warriors up? The first and second place warriors will go first. So, Tharsil and Zarto, you will take the first challenge together. Zarto, Tharsil, you lead this band right now, 
but one of you potentially could be taking first place away from the other. Are you both ready to face the first true trial of the tre the quest? Yeah, sure, sure, whatever, lol. Yeah, I'm ready. Then, warriors, let the challenge begin. Right. Whew. This is some oh. intense stuff right here. Whew. Both warriors have made it to the chest. Oh, I... No, 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 don't you dare. You think we both want to win this? Realize that. But Tharsa win. takes the oh. gold. That was an impressive display, warriors. Good I feared game. to talk lest I knocked Gee. one of you into the water, so well done to both of you. Even though Zarto... You will be losing a life. My heart yeah. is pounding. <laughs> Madrad, Alarkai, this challenge will determine which of you potentially will take second place. Are you both ready to face this challenge? Yep. Yeah. Then warriors, let the challenge begin. This challenge yes. goes to Alarkai oh, yes. as Madrad falls into the loch. That truly was a close battle, Warriors. Oh, Let's go. Alarkai, the ring is yours. Madrad, your life will be forfeit. Hedony, Talro, you are both in joint last place. One of you could take a chance ahead, but the other will fall even further down with no rings to hold themselves. Are you both ready to face this challenge? No. Uh, if I ever be, but let's give it a try. Honest answers, warriors. Well then, let the challenge begin. Weehoo! Slowly steady. Slowly steady. Wee! And, uh, whoop de doo how are oh, you here on A? I'm all fine and dandy. Talro is slightly ahead, but Head and I could easily catch up. I'm not ahead, I have a body the two. Jeez, um... Jeez! Uh, Luckily, we don't have pushing. Really? Uh. Warrior, okay. you must go on to the glowstone platform before you open your chest. Okay, uh, then boop, and there we go. This could be a uh, game. But could Tower's yeah. mistake have cost him? Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. Hedony takes it by a second. Talro, your mistake at the ring post has cost you a life, but Hironi, oh, you've uh, gained your first ring. Warriors, I have not seen an intense battle of the stepping stones for quite some time. All of you should be proud of your efforts, as it was a close game for each of you. However, for you, Alarkai, you, Hironi, and you, Tharsil, you made it to the end first. You have done your emblems proud. Place your ring on your standard. However, for Talro, Zarto, and Madrad, you all failed the challenge. And Madrad, you even fell into the loch, getting your clothes a little wet. Suffice it to say, I am not pleased. And as such, you must lose a precious life. Now then, warriors, this day is yet only beginning. Head to your left to find your next challenge. Is 
So that challenge was an incredibly intense one, uh, especially with the current the current course. And I feel like I feel like I did really well, and um, my opponent did really well as well. Well, after the first challenge, I wasn't confident at all. I thought I could have performed much better, but now, uh, now knowing that I haven't lost a life and I've at least one ring, uh, I'm feeling pretty good. So yeah. Well, you know how I'm the cloud of all people. Well, I was too high until now. I should get down a little bit. What are yours? This challenge is now being adopted by your series of tournaments, and it is one that I truly am quite fond of. This is the Raging Torrent. The awesome might of this waterfall is something that you will have to climb should you wish to get to the challenge. Climb to the top and collect a boat from the chests perched high above these waters. Then you must use your boat to swim through this lake and make it to the far side. But beware, if your boat breaks, you will have to use the lily pads to traverse your way through. Once you make it to the end, you will have to cross this enchanted water held up by the spirits of this lake. You must make it to the platform at the very top of the lake, where rings will be awaiting the warriors who make it to the end. The first warrior to make it to the platform will gain three gold rings, the second two gold rings, and the third one gold ring. But the warrior who comes in last place will lose a life, but the warriors in fourth and fifth place will be safe. So warriors, though you can gain rings, this is a game about preservation. And make sure not to punch any warriors along the way, for if you do, you will instantly lose a life for being a foul sport. Warriors, are you ready to get wet and climb this waterfall to gain rings? Sure. We don't have a choice. No. Pretty much. Uh, I'm a clown, so I have to absorb no. the water. That is true, Heroni. You do not have a choice. Well then, warriors, let the challenge begin. Oh no. Yep, I see the problem. All of the warriors are cringing at this challenge, as it is tedious as all hell. Well, I'm actually enjoying this. Well, Tharsil, Talro, well. and Alarkai are leading the group. While at the very back... Yeah. Oh, well, no, they are all grouped together now. But Tharsil and Talro are evident leads, by a millimeter. <laughs> True. We haven't even got to the water park. Don't you mean a melee later? Everything will change once the, you know, the water park core Sarsil comes. is the quickest to the top, followed by Madrad. They may climb on the leaves to cross to the parkour, or the section if they wish, or they can just swim through the water, whichever they find quicker. Yeah. Swimming is fun. Tharsil is first to his platform. Followed by Madrad ah. and Zarto. The other three warriors now emerge as well. Oi! Got it. Oh, drop that, damn it. Oh, ah. I'm sorry. Someone broke my bow. Remember, yeah, warriors, you do not need to come first, second, or third in order to preserve your lives. Merely don't come last. Tharsil well, and Alarko. Our ring is always good. Zarto is here. Where are Madrad and Hedoni, I wonder? They must have fallen out of their boats. Tharsil is making quick work of this challenge. Oh, Larkai falls. Will Tharsil take another first place victory? Wouldn't be surprised. If he does, I'm this jump to is him. hard. Tharsil takes first place, gaining three more okay. rings. He is the warrior he to beat to be now. He needs to be targeted. Yes. <laughs> Zarto is currently okay, second along, it. but he could I'll easily miss this target. jump. You go first. Go first. Thank you. Kind sir. I'm currently waiting on a full all the challenges for Giant Park are right no. here, but I'm not going to be in first. Oh wait, whoa! Zarto oh. is almost here. He merely needs to make a few more adjustments <sighs> and he will make it to the end. Josh, you can do it. Nice easy jump, okay. Yes. Zarto Let's takes go. second place, gaining two gold rings. A repeat of Warrior's Race? 
And if Madrad really? makes it in third place, it truly will be a repeat. Come on, Madrad. <coughs> Got a couple more jumps. Oh, okay. fuck's sake! Oh, no, there's no more jumps. There are no more jumps. Madrad oh. takes third place. Well done. It is a repeat of Warrior's race. Now <laughs> it is not. between Heroni, Talro, and Alarkai to figure out who will be losing a life. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Talro, uh, just take your time. Yeah, I, I'd love to, but no. Yeah, that jump is gonna be a pain. Uh. So guys, what are you doing? Uh, Talro, I, I believe you can go straight Yay! from yeah, yeah. Okay, nice, 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 Talro simple is jump. Now no, further go. ahead. No. But if he falters, uh, it could be disastrous. Talro, careful. Talro. Go on, oh, the, seriously? Don't go on the uh, top okay. block. Talro, Talro made a mistake. You, you want to go from his... Talro, uh, distance what, what, what advantage. Warriors that have finished, do not give them hints. It is unfair oh. on the other two warriors playing. Yeah. Go climb a like mountain. Everyone. Go climb a mountain everyone. like Jassar did. Everyone. Maybe you can do the lyric of a song? Alarkai has made it past the tough part. The rest of the challenge is fairly simple, but he could still fail. Hedony has made it past the tough part. But now comes the rest of the challenge. <sighs> If Heroni fails and Mez makes it, it is true. Talro has fallen. Alarkai makes it go. in fourth place. Hedoni <sighs> merely needs to make it to the platform to spell doom for Talro. I swear if he failed this jump. Oh. oh, I wouldn't put it past me. What the hell? Oh. Will Hedoni. Will he mm. land on the platform? Hedoni <laughs> lands on the platform. Oh, Talro, I am sorry, Warrior, but you will be losing the life this challenge. Meh, I'll manage. Warriors, you fared much better than the other Warriors that faced this challenge long ago. You conquered this water parkour, and for five of you, it was successful. But for three of you, you gained riches. Tharsil, Zarto, Madrad, it was a repeat of Warrior's race. And you gain the same amount of rings as you did there. Place them on your standards. Oh. Tharsil, were you being generous to Zarto there, or...? No. Uh, it was an accident. Good to hear. Alarki and Hedony, though you did not gain rings, you were able to sustain your lives by coming in fourth and fifth respectively. But Talro, I feel for you, warrior. You... Came in last place, and though it was a close fought race, you must lose a life. But do not worry, Talro, for as your name suggests, at least you know how to handle a boat. Now then, warriors, we will move to the next challenge, where you must run to your right this time. I'm actually really happy. I can't believe I actually didn't lose a life there. I really thought that. Talro was gonna overtake me at the end, but luckily I managed to keep my calm. I feel really nice. I actually did, and I think I actually did really well. And I'm actually happy for um, uh, Tarsal that he got three rings. So I got two rings, and I feel really happy about that. I feel that I could definitely improve from where I am. I feel that there is plenty of opportunity for me to gather more rings and overtake places and move up the leaderboard. Warriors, it is time for you to emerge from this ancient abode. Come outside, warriors, for you will be facing the diving board of the nobles, the Lock Leap. This place was once home to many nobles of this land. They used to have parties here, and thus they required a diving board into their rather massive riverside pool. Your job and challenge is to leap from the jetty and flick the levers as you fall. Flicking each lever will gain you a ring. Do not worry if you flick the lever on and then off. You will keep the ring. But when you land at the bottom, swim to the boat and you'll be safe. However, if you fail to gain any rings at this challenge, like some of the warriors before you, you will have to sacrifice a precious life. And this time, it is all on your own skill. So then, 
Who will go first? I feel our first place warrior will go first. Tharsil, you're the first warrior to leap from this jetty. Are you ready to take on this challenge? Not really, but I'll give it a shot. Well, warrior, oh may your emblem guide you in this watery challenge. Let the challenge begin. Right, so this is where I'm going to mess up. Okay. So I want to be about here. Facing about there, and... No! Tharsil, oh, you missed all three levers. It is more difficult than it appears. It was and as such, than I thought it was actually. You will be losing a life. I... I... I overestimated that. I, I... Ignoring you, warrior. We are going to go to a larky. A larky. A larky. <laughs> this is going to take some getting used to, but you yeah. you understand, a larky. I, 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 I apologize. Oh, that's fine. You have a good tunic. Thank you. Yeah, I do. Now then, you. are you ready to face this challenge, a larky? Yeah, let's give it a go. Well, let the challenge begin. Right, I'm gonna try a different strategy. Like most MLG professionals, he sizes up the jump before he jumps. Okay, I'm gonna hope this works. Yes! Yes! Larkai, a ring is yours. A very good display. Well done, warrior. Now, Hedony, you are next. Oh boy. You need to gain a ring here in order to keep up with a Larkai. Yep. Are you ready? Well, all the water based times so far have given me decent luck, so I hope so. Except step. Wait, no, you won stepping stones. Yes, you did. Yes, yes, yes you did. will do fine. You <laughs> will do fine, Hedony. <laughs> For the challenge, begin. Mm, let's see what we have up against. As I will I tell know. every warrior, you do need momentum for this. Um, I'm doomed, so. Oh my god. <laughs> Hedony, you did not calculate your momentum jump, and you jumped over the jetty. And this I'm is sorry, warrior, but you will be losing a life. Next, we will have Zarto. I can hear a warrior typing. Who is that? Sorry. <sighs> Zarto, are you ready to face this challenge? Ready. Then, warrior, let the challenge begin. Okay. As sizing up the jetty. Yes! Zarto, a ring is yours. Well done, warrior. Okay. Now then, Madrad, it is your turn. Are you ready? to face this jetty and hopefully gain a ring? As ready as I'll ever be. Well then, warrior. Let the challenge begin. Madrad, yes. you have matched their efforts. The ring Ooh. is yours. Well done. And that leaves only you, Talro. Ooh. You are the only warrior left, but which camp will you join? Will you join Alarkai, Zarto, and Madrad with a ring? Or perhaps more? Well, or Raven. will you falter with Hedony and Tharsil? Well, that depends, Raven, on today's forecast. On is it going to be cloudy or not? <sighs> we'll see. Well then, warrior, let the challenge begin. Uh, I have a little bit ahead of me, but uh, sorry. Uh-huh. Uh yeah, uh huh. Okay, so that's Let's kind see. of a uh, um, amount that I need. Kind of, maybe, probably not, but I'm gonna fail anyway. So, uh, boom, boom! Uh, don't fail me now. You gained a ring, the bottom lever. Woo! Talro, like most cloud warriors, you have gained your first ring at Lock Leap. Wow! Well done. Woohoo! Warriors, that was truly an impressive display from most of you. This is a difficult challenge, I will admit. And for four of you, rings were gained. Alarkai, Madrad, Zarto, and Talro. You each gained rings, and Talro, you gained your first ring. 
place them on your standards with pride. However, Tharsil and Heroni, I said that warriors in first and second place may find their positions fleeting. And, as you can see, you will have to lose a life for your negligence. And with that, warriors, the leaderboard changes yet again. But with one more challenge to do this day, I think it's time to team you up. Jump off of the boat and continue on the quest. First gold, it's great. Let's hope it's gonna be a golden shower from now on. You know, one minute you're living the high life, drinking champagne out of champagne glasses and not losing any lives. And then the next minute, you know, you lose a life in a challenge because you're pressing space at the wrong time. Uh, I'm extremely disappointed in myself because that was a massive miscalculation on my part. I definitely could have done better in that challenge and I really hope in the next challenge I can bounce my way back up and put the moon in, in its rightful place. Warriors, it is time that I tested you on a completely new challenge that no warrior has tested before. I have made warriors face each other with fishing rods, punching, and many other implements. But never before have I had a straight up bow battle. And so we will test your archery skills against each other in this, the castle courtyard. Here, you will be split into teams of three and you must face the other team in combat. Be wary, for if you take damage, regeneration is not a thing in this challenge. And you must make sure that your team survives and the other team falls. The first team to emerge victorious and defeat the other team will gain two rings each per warrior. The other team will have to sacrifice a life. Warriors, are you both teams ready to face each other in this mock combat arena? Yeah, sure. Yep, ready! A bit nervous, but you know, that's how it is. Well then, warriors, let the challenge begin. All, right. All of the teams have emerged. They must be swift and careful if they wish to survive. Oh god! Careful. Hmm. I'm trying to find where everyone is. Zarto has taken a few hits. Madrad took a hit there. With no regen, their health will be dropping. It is only a matter of time before a warrior is lost. I haven't seen Farsil, so I don't know if you guys can see. Shooting, no! Farsil. Try not to stand oh in front of me, Zato. Okay. Talro hits Hedony from afar, and Hedony retreats. Oh, God. Oh. Looks oh, like the you. cloud covered the moon. Eh. I see you. I see you there. There you go. When a warrior announces, I see you when they're trying to be stealthy. That doesn't really work out. It seems so. Uh, moving He's back a little gone. bit. Where'd He's... you go? Where'd you go? I left the tree. Guys, try to hide and use the F5 to find where they are. Don't you mean. Oh, pros. Oh, okay. Pros from the pros. None of the warriors have been lost yet, correct? Uh, yeah, no, 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 no. That is a true statement, so far. All of the warriors are being very reserved. And none of the warriors are regening health, if I am correct, yes? 
I mean, I haven't taken a hit. Well, warriors that have been hit, you haven't regen, have you? I have regen right now. Good. And soon, one of you will fall from negligence or ah, otherwise. Son of a... No, I should have done Silence is deafening as the warriors continue to hunt. It's clear they are all skilled. But someone mm. must fall. I'm trying to find a good angle. That's what I'm trying to do. Use your mathematic skills to the best of your ability, warrior. That's what I'll do. Thank you. Oh. But remember, you do not need to discover the circumference of the sun to put an arrow for your friend's brains. Medrad has fallen. Nice. Oh, oh my god. And Tharsil has fallen. Talro is making this a single operation. Guys, oh, push him, oh, push him, oh, push him. Came behind enemy lines. Go, go, go! Push him, push him, push him. And Heroni and Talro fall, but... Yes! yes. Talro, yes. coming from nice behind mess. enemy oh. lines that entire time, wiped out the enemy. entire team. Well done. Oh, yeah. Zarto, Alarkai, you were a part of the winning team along with fellow Talro, who single-handedly took out most of the other warriors. I will bring him, Hedony, Medrad, and Tharsil back from the depths. Warriors, I have brought you back for the first time this tournament. It is not a nice feeling to be lost from the quest like that. But Talro, you were able to be on the winning team despite faltering. And for your efforts, <sighs> you have gained two gold rings along with Alarkai and Zarto. All three of you, place your rings on your standard. This changes the leaderboard significantly, as Hedony, Medrad and Tharsil, you all were defeated. You must pay the price of being brought back with the loss of a life. But do not despair, warriors, for this is only the first day of trials. And though Alarki, Larkai, you may be in first place at the moment, it could all change as Tharsil once was. And Hedony, though you may be in last place, many a warrior has caught up on the second day. So for all of you, no despair, only cheer. Now then, warriors, head down the cliff, and I will bid you farewell for this day. Well, I have to give props to Talro for that sneak attack. That was incredibly well done, and I wish I thought of the same. Um, but instead, I was too busy running on top of a rock, shooting at the other team, running underneath the rock, shooting at the other team, and just go. It was very painful when I was shot by the arrow. I, I thought I was being shot in the side by someone, but when I looked, I guess my vision was clouded. Uh, I know I'm in last place, but as you said, uh, I'm only uh, two lives, two rings, excuse me, from catching up with uh, Taro, who, by the way, was amazing. These warriors are tough. I wonder how they will fare in tomorrow's challenges. We shall see. Next time on Raven. Can any warriors defeat the castle walls? How will Hedony fare on the new pontoon pursuit? Who will falter on the climb to victory at Pole Climb? And who will be the next warrior eliminated at the Way of the Warrior? <laughs>